Hey, hello and welcome to this video. In this video, I want to show you how you can convert your current windows with all applications, all software settings and tools to a portable Windows installation, Windows to go on a USB hard disk, USB drive or SSD or USB stick within to USB. You will use this software to create the portable Windows installation. In our example, we will use a hard drive, a USB hard drive for that. It's not quite fast, but it does the job. If you want a fast Windows, you should use an SSD and USB SSD. Okay, let's get started. We will use the software Win to USB. And you can download it here from this homepage. I will put the link in the video description. The basic version is free and the pro version is, uh, well, available as of $30. Uh, there are some li limitations for the free version. For example, you can only convert Windows Home Edition. If you have a professional edition, you need to buy the upgrade. Okay, let's get started. Okay, now I'm here on my Windows 11 computer here. And I've already started the software here. It's a free version here. And this is the main menu. And we have these options here on the main menu. And what we are going to use is, uh, is this first option here, Windows to go USB. And it's quite simple to use. First, we have to select the source here, or installation source. Uh, so we can select Windows, uh, current Windows operating system. This will clone our currently installed Windows we are using here right now. And then we have to select a destination device. In our case here, our connected USB hard disk. We can do several settings here. For example, we can change the partition scheme. Um, we can keep the existing or use whatever we want to use. And we can also select this installation mode. We can use legacy, which will then use the, the complete hard disk here. Or we can uh, put the image into a virtual hard disk here. We will use the basic mode here is installation mode and click on proceed. Then we will get a warning here that all data will be lost on that device because it's going to be formatted. So if you have any data on your USB drive here, back up it first. Hit yes. And then the cloning process starts here. You can see it here. There's a percentage um, and it will take some time. Depends on how much, how big your Windows installation is and also how fast your hard disk and USB drive is. So it will take a few minutes here and we will skip forward. Okay, we are now finished and let's check the USB hard drive or the converted windows if we can boot from it. Okay, I have connected the hard disk to my computer here and I've selected the USB hard drive in the boot menu, which I opened from the BIOS and the Windows logo appears. It takes some time. The hard disk is not very fast. If you install Windows 11 on a regular hard drive, it will be very slow. So if you want to use it on a regular basis, I recommend using an SS USB SSD. The login screen appears. And after that, our Windows should now boot up with all our applications and settings. So basically, we have now converted our Windows installation into a portable Windows to go which we can use on any computer.